Well, it's all over in New York. Tennis legend Serena Williams has lost in the third round of the U.S. Open, widely expected to be her final tournament. It's over. There it was there, Australian Isla Tomjanovic beat Williams after a furious three-set battle, denying her a chance at another Grand Slam win in the final days of her career. Chris Reyes is at Arthur Ashe Stadium in New York. She's been there all night. What <laughs> drama to witness, Chris. Vashi, it was hard to believe that was a third round game. It had the intensity of a Grand Slam final. It was more than three hours long. And that final game that Australia's uh, Tamlanovic struggled to close lasted about 10 minutes. And really, Vashi, in those final points, you really saw the grit and determination and, and fighting spirit that Serena is famous for. So this match didn't have a fairy tale ending for her fans but they still cheered on cheered her like she won and you know we, we knew this was not going to end like a regular game normally the winner would take the mic but that wasn't going to be the case serena had the final word right after the match have to listen to what she said just thank everyone that's here that's been on my side so many years decades oh my gosh literally decades um but it all started with my parents, and they deserve everything. So I'm really grateful for them. So the big question, really, what comes next for Serena, Chris? Uh -huh. That was such an emotional moment first, Vashi. And she, by the way, also mentioned her sister saying there would be no Serena without Venus. So what's next? Well, we, we uh, listened to her in, in that Vogue article say that she wants to expand her family, that Olympia has been asking for a sister. She also wants to grow Serena Ventures. You know, she's been a champion for women, women of color, black women, and no doubt she's not going to stop doing that. But when she was asked, is this really the end? This is what she had to say. The quality of this match was yeah. unreal. Is there yeah. any chance you'll reconsider? <laughs> I mean, I'm literally playing my way into this and getting better. I should have started sooner this year. Um, I, don't, I don't think so, but you never know. Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty vague, right? You know, I think no matter what happens, even if she comes back, today was a, a day for the history books. I ran in right after our hit. I just watched her as she walked out and walked off the court. And you could feel, you could sense from her fans that they were watching history and happy to be there. So happy to be there, Vashi. The crowd kind of loved the never say never, eh, Chris? <laughs> Thanks a lot, Chris. Absolutely. Chris for us in Thank New York you. tonight.